welcome back. So um, today's vlog is going to be a trip that we're taking to Venice, Italy. Uh, currently we are in the R R, which is the train that takes us from um, Paris to Charles de Gaulle Airport. So for anybody that has traveled to Paris that has needed to go to the airport directly, the RER A to RRB will take you there. I'm going to go ahead and film a, a little bit more once we get to the airport and then on the airplane and then as we land. So keep you posted. guys so we are in the Charles de Gaulle airport now walking to our gate yeah I thought there would be a lot more people here but I guess because it's a Thursday there's not that many people so it's kind of been nice Hi y'all, so we're now in Venice and um, we had to take a bus from the airport in order to get here, but we're here now. Um, we're walking around kind of looking for like a place to eat. So that's interesting. William's kind of cranky, sorry about that. Um, but I'll just uh, go ahead and show you guys a little bit of the, uh, the view here. So it's 7 o'clock at night and um, we are, we found a little restaurant uh, within like our neighborhood. It's really, really nice. Uh, they do have some like traditional um, Venetian, Venetian, how do you say that? Venetian? Venetian? Uh, Venetian dishes. So we're just waiting on our food to get here. So as soon as that I, that gets here, I'm gonna go ahead and um, show you guys a little bit about that. Um, and then just for the time being, um, we're enjoying a little bit of bread, a little bit of wine, a little bit of sparkling water. So I think what we're probably gonna do after this is go back to the hotel and then we're going to um, just get ready for bed, get prepared for our little adventure tomorrow. Good morning, friends. So we are in Venice, as I said before. Um, we actually just woke up in our hotel room. Um, I think some of the things that we're going to be doing uh, this morning are going to get some coffee. There's no Starbucks in Italy and that's totally fine because the coffee here is wonderful. So I guess some of the things that we're going to be doing this morning, we're going to check out the Piazza San Marco which is kind of close to our hotel. 
I'll go ahead and link some of the places that we went to in the description down below. And I'll also go ahead and link the hotel that we stayed at and um, the two restaurants that we tried last night. Um, one of them near us was so budget friendly. We shared uh, a lot of my pesto pasta with Will, which he loves. We are going to be exploring this morning, basically at the piazza. I think we might be doing a gondola ride either today or tomorrow. And then we're going to be checking out um, a couple of other things. So I wanna check out the Santa Maria uh, di Miracoli Church. I wanna also check out the Jewish Museum. Um, that's pretty interesting. It's, a, it's like near a place called Campo del Ghetto Nuevo or Campo del Ghetto Nuevo. I'm sorry if I'm butchering it. And then we're also um, gonna try and do maybe a little shopping. We don't know yet. But other than that, I'll go ahead and be recording throughout the day. So see you soon. All right, so we just recently left our hotel. <laughs> and we just bumped into this building. I think this building right here is the one from uh, James Bond, the Skyfall movie. But I'm not 100% sure. And we're kind of trying to figure out a way to cross. So we're kind of like sitting ducks like right here on the sidewalk almost and we need to cross this river so I think we're going to go over here and try and figure that out and see where that leads us to. We stopped uh, at the pharmacy for a little bit because we needed to get Will a new pacifier. He has been teething, so he kind of chewed his up. Um, and I found something interesting as well too, that they, I guess they just do this at all the European pharmacies. They have a dispensing machine outside of the pharmacy where you can basically get like condoms and lotions, there's also tampons in there, it's, and, oh, they, there's also some spray, mosquito spray, so that's really cool. Hey y'all, so right now we are uh, kind of just walking through the city, um, it's really been super beautiful. Um, and also since this morning, since this morning we've also had lunch. Um, another thing that we're doing right now is we're actually taking money out of the ATM to uh, go on a gondola ride. So we're gonna be doing that next. I'm wearing William right now. He's in a, he's in a baby carrier behind me. Um, so I think we're gonna do the gondola and then I, I don't know what we're gonna do after that. We're gonna walk some more after that. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and uh, take some footage of the gondola as we do that. And I'll keep you guys posted. Finish it. Uh, just the weekend. The, the weekend, weekend. Yeah. 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 So, uh, the fin de semana. Yeah. Oui. 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 Oui.
eh, esquina, fondo de esta. We just got off our gondola ride. It was definitely like a once in a lifetime experience to do that, especially in Venice. Um, now we're at uh, Piazza San Marco, I think it's called. And it is stunning. This church behind me is incredible. And I'm gonna go ahead and take a little bit more of an aerial view of what you guys are gonna see of the piazza. Hey y'all, it's about 6.30 in the evening. Um, there's a lot of walking that we did today, so I'm kind of pooped. Um, but now we're going back to the hotel. So once we're back at the hotel, I'll give you guys a quick hotel tour. And then once we go ahead and get freshened up and stuff, we're gonna go to dinner. So I'll keep you posted on that and we'll see how it goes from there. Hello everyone. So we just got to our hotel room and I'm gonna show you uh, what it looks like so you guys can have a good idea budget-wise how much a hotel like this costs. Okay, so the first thing is um, obviously coming through this store. This is the entryway. And then there's a little closet right here, mirror right here. Hello. And then we'll open this and there's some hangers, a little safe for, um, you know, like passports and all of that extra pillow. And then this is, this is what our bathroom looks like. Sink, bidet, toilet, and then that shower opens up that and then over here in the bedroom area we um, pre-requested this cot this baby cot before so that was nice my husband did that um, and this is our little bed it's a little hard as rock but it's okay and then we have this like kind of cubby area where we just like put all our junk and stuff um, after we have uh, come home from the day uh, from just walking around and then we have a TV up here and then this is from the far angle um, where the bed is uh, where the baby bed is and then we just have like some coffee cups right here um, glasses for water and a little tea kettle Good morning! So we uh, 
Um, got back to the hotel last night. Had a good night's rest. Today we are going to go on a boat tour. Um, it costs about like 20 euros each, so we're going to be eating that. And we are going to go on that boat tour. It's going to be like a five hour boat tour, which is good. Like, it's going to take us to, I think, three of the islands. Um, so we're going to be doing that. And then, yeah, we're going to keep you posted. I'm actually going to do some a, a little shopping at Mango because it's right next door to the cafe that we're at right now for breakfast. Um, and I'll just record a little bit about like what you know I'm going to find there. Hopefully something nice. So I'll, I'll show you guys the cafe we're at and what it looks like. So this is what our cafe looks like. This is the name of here. I'll probably have to get like a better view of it when we leave, but yeah. Um, and it's really nice because they are serving um, like coffee, juice. We got like a little bit of coffee, a little bit of juice for myself and for Will. Um, some croissants and uh, that muffin's not from here. <laughs> I got that muffin from Air France. Um, but other than that, uh, yeah, breakfast is pretty minimal here. It's not like, you know, bacon, eggs, pancakes. I wish it was, but um, that's okay. Uh, so yeah, well, I'll keep you posted on the boat tour that we're gonna take and see you in a bit. So we actually just came to a playground um, to let Will kind of like blow off some steam because, you know, when you're traveling with kids, you just have to find a, a park that's really going to let them just like burn some energy. Um, so this park, I'm going to go ahead and link it in the description. It's called Parco Sabor Saborganan. And I'll link it in the description. It's a little hard for me to pronounce. Um, so yeah, there's like a bunch of kids here. I don't know if you could hear me very well. There's a lot of kids here. There's a lot of parents here. They have slides here for kids if you're traveling with like small toddlers. Um, I think maybe like around the ages of like two to five is the age. And um, yeah, right now my husband's like pushing my <laughs> sun on a swing so it's super cute so yeah we're having a lot of fun and um it's probably like an hour and a half before our boat ride so um we're just kind of like waiting until then to take our boat ride um and yeah so i went to mango earlier and some of the stuff was okay um but i actually found a different store here called ovs it's actually pretty good um so i'll go ahead and, and film that if i can uh, but other than that, I'll go ahead and uh, keep you guys posted. It takes 15-20 years to learn all the techniques 
pretend to be a good master you spend everything by your talent, by your skill. If you have no talent, you can't be the next one. So we just took a boat ride um, to our second island now. The first island was an island that's famous for glass, like glass artists. And the first island, what's the name of the first island? Murano. Murano. This one is a little bit more different. It's not really like known for anything, I think. It's just more of like a chill, like Italian lifestyle. So you'll see what I mean. I'll, I'll take a couple of shots. So here is an old vineyard that's next to a church and this building right here is the church and this is the old vineyard and as you can tell it's pretty quiet, very quiet island, not a whole lot of commotion like Venice but here's a little bit more of the vineyard. So guys, here we are, third island. This tour is almost over. It's been about five hours or so. But I just wanted to get some quick shots of these houses because they are so colorful and it's just really beautiful in fact. So just wanted to get some cute shots. I think um, the tour guide that we were with, she was saying that this island is kind of like famous for its biscotti. So super excited about that. Um, so we're going over here, checking out the houses and just can't believe like how colorful they are. They're stunning. that we're on right now is called Burano and 
and it's a really colorful island. A lot of the houses are different colors, red, pink, green, yellows, blues. Um, it's all very, very authentic. So um, yeah, we're just strolling around, really enjoying our time. <laughs> I'm just making sure my toddler isn't gonna fall. And um, yeah, we're actually getting um, really like navigating the city really well uh, with our stroller, so it's not too bad. Uh, so we're, you know, trying to get by and yeah, we're gonna be heading, walking back to our boat now to take it back to Venice, the main island. I'll keep you posted when we return. So we just left the boat tour. Um, it was really good. It was like five hours long though. And we went to like three islands, but it was good overall. Like we had a lot of fun checking out all the islands. I love this view of Venice. It reminds me of, I think I said this at the beginning of our trip. It reminds me of James Bond, the James Bond movie. I think it was Die Another Day or Casino Royale, one of those, I can't really remember. But I remember in the scene, he goes to Venice and the like girl that he like dies in like one of these buildings, I can't remember. Anyways, so now we're gonna get ready for dinner. Go eat some lovely pasta and lovely pizza. One last time before we go back to Paris. Very early tomorrow, by the way. Very early morning flight. Six in the morning. Do not recommend that to anyone. I have to wake up at like the crack of dawn. But I'll keep you posted about dinner. Complete. A breve chiuderemo le porte.